And they even have a trick art museum right here at Fairytale Village. Here's some of the various exhibits that you can see here. So it's about 6,000 won to enter. We went to a similar museum in 2017 at Hongdae. It was called the Trick Eye Museum, so I'm excited to see what this place has. The trick art story is super inexpensive, and I think under 12 are completely free. This entire museum has paintings that uses perspective to make them appear three-dimensional. Okay, so when you're in here, in the art story, the art story museum, make sure you look for the photo zone areas. That's the place to stand while you're taking your picture. And make sure you download their app. It allows you to record special AR videos for certain exhibits. There Nolan is, breaking the door down. Wow, Nolan, you're strong. You always gotta have something like this. Wow. Why? <laughs> Why did they have to do that? I can't be sure, but I think they're covertly promoting urine therapy. We were now ready to go to the second floor. Wow, they even have paintings in the stairwell. Huh? What's up here? Oh, cool. Ah, oh, the mermaid's giving you some pearls. You're really helping her brush her teeth. She's gonna have very clean teeth because of you. Thank you. Watch out, there's a big shark right there. Watch out. Hey, Ellie, save the chicken, hurry. There's a big lion about to get it. You gotta save it, quick! Are you feeding the penguin, Ellie? You feeding the penguin? Just smile and wave, boy. Oh, the penguin likes that. Okay, and this last exhibit is the motion floor. Let me see how this works. Oh, yeah! There you go. Get him! Get those gophers. I don't like gophers. As a gardener, I do this in real life. <gasps> I may need to take a moment. This is bringing back some bad memories. It's cool how the museum tries to add other interactive exhibits. I heard they recently renovated and installed a Wizard of Oz race. I'll need to come back to try it out. This is the last room. In this room, everything is lit with black light, and special paint was used to make the artwork glow. And adjacent to this area is the mirror maze. It was a bit disorienting in there, but that's what made it fun. All right, just finished the mirror maze. You, de you basically, strategy, use your feet to check if there is a mirror in front of you because if not, you're probably gonna bump into a mirror. So although I wish there was more, this was pretty much it. The entire museum can be completed in about 30 minutes. But the real value is all the fun memories you'll get to photograph. Thank you for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, here's some more suggestions. And as always, please like, subscribe, and press the bell for notifications. And I'll see you on the next Kim's Adventure.